Nathan Erasmus has ordered that the report on Zandile Mafia's medical condition should not be made public just yet. He was arrested last year for allegedly setting parliament alight, resulting in about two billion rand in damage. Mafia's lawyers still need to decide whether they will accept the findings that are contained in this report. Asha Ismail was in court for us. She's back. She's in our studios in Cape Town just to give us the latest or give us an update about what happened in court today. Uh, good evening, Aisha. So what happened in court? So in March this year, Judge Nathan Erasmus um, ordered that Zandile Mafia be sent to a psychiatric institution, um, Fort England um, Psychiatric Hospital in the Eastern Cape. And the reason for that was that he was meant to undergo a psychiatric evaluation to determine whether he would be medically fit to stand trial. Now, that was for 30 days. The evaluation has been done. There, um, a report has been filed and that report was then given to the judge and also shared with the state as well as with Zandile Mafia's lawyers. Zandile Mafia's lawyers did not have an opportunity to consult with him because he was in the Eastern Cape and um, and of course they were in different provinces. So the judge did not want Mafia to hear the outcome of his diagnosis in court today and it is for this reason that he had ordered that the report be sealed until such time that his lawyers had consulted with him but this is what judge Nathan Erasmus had to say I'm going to order that the contents of the report which is styled the psychiatric report not be disclosed at this stage for the following reasons the Act provides that a party may dispute the findings in these type of reports. And in the instant matter, the defense had not had an opportunity to consult with a client about it. <laughs> Whether they want to dispute it or not. It goes to his medical condition and I will therefore give them that opportunity to consult. In the event that an agreement is reached, on the findings before the next date I shall issue an order that the full contents of the court file can be disclosed. M meanwhile Aisha what's going to happen to Mr. Mafe? So the matter's been postponed to the 13th of July um, to give um, Mafia's lawyers an opportunity to consult with him. And then, of course, once they've consulted with him, they will then make a determination whether to accept the report or to challenge the report. In the meantime, the judge also made a further ruling regarding the incarceration of Zandele Mafia. In light of the prima facie findings presented to me, I am going to order that the accused, Mr. Murphy, be detained in the hospital section of the prison. And I, I will endorse his warrant of detention to that effect. To give sufficient time for the consultations to take place, a decision to be made on the way forward, and the potential second stage of Section 77, where evidence might be led. I've determined in consultation with the legal representatives for the state and the defense. That's Judge Nathan Erasmus in the Western Cape earlier today in that matter of the alleged parliament arsonist Zandile Mafe, concluding that update from Aisha Ismail. And still